Buy a pair. Well, there is a lot of choices. There's always a, a lot of websites you can go to. Uh huh. You can visit stores like the Boot Barn online. They carry my boot boots. Boot Barn? Yes. The snake down there, you see that? Yeah. Yes, yeah, so it was that. Uh, uh, if you really want to go crazy, uh -huh. get the boots with the gator head. The gator head? You see the teeth there? It, it draws attention, huh? Yeah. yeah. What is it made out of? It's gator. It's crocodile. Gator. Genuine crocodile. Really? And they yeah. just mold it into the shape of the head? It just, it's the actual head. That's a real head? That's a real head. A baby <laughs> That's thought, a real head. I thought they molded it into no, that. Oh, no. no. It's, uh, it's real. a baby gator. Oh, that's a cool boom, Mikey. How about that? I like snake. that. Oh, it's a real snake. What is this, python? Uh, cobra. 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 Yeah. Cobra. Who wears those boots? Anybody? Oh, we sell them all over the states. Let me ask you a question. I've been asking people for the last two days. No one could give me an answer. How do you wear cowboy boots? Do you wear like sports socks, white socks, or do you, like It's silk? more like silk socks. Really? For a better uh, slip on. Slip I didn't know that. Yeah. I learned something new. I, I know wherever I travel, from Texas to Colorado, very popular. Everybody wears cowboy boots. Yeah. Boots, cowboy boots sell all over the state, but it's very, very strong in the Texas area. Yeah, Texas, of course, uh, you know, even... Kansas, Oklahoma, all the Midwest, they love cowboy boots. They love Los Altos. They love us. Check this out. Got the matching... Oh, that's cool. Belt that is cool. Boots. <laughs> that's really cool. So, Mikey, why do you like cowboy boots? I mean, you could wear gym shoes, you could wear any yeah. shoe you well, can. I don't have one right now. But no, but I usually wear, you do, like I a lot of times. Seen it? Yeah. I bought some in Texas out you, there. I know. Because I me compré unas de, de elefante, ya. Yeah. Oh, de elefante. Fui en Texas y fuimos a una tienda a comprar un cinto. Ya, yeah, miré unas botas ahí. Ya estuve curioseando y miré unas de elefante. Me gustaron las. las ya de, tenemos de elefante aquí, ¿para qué andas buscando? Ahí. Tengo unas tuyas de elefante. Oh, ok. Tengo unas. Las compré ahí con Tony. Okay. De, tienen aquí el, la, la parte de mejor oh, de sí, sí, este, el, este estilo como que... Sí, anda la cima, sí, pero de elefante. Igual estas son las palitas. Pero no creo una de muy bonitas. Esa la agarré ahí de, de Tony. Pero puedes ver, tenemos todos los tipos de these are bad, look. Full alligator. All the way to the top. See that? From head to toe. Head to toe. And what did they go for, usually, a pair of boots? Well, at the stores, they start like uh, from like 259 mm -hmm. all the way to $800, $900. Really? Estas. For $900, for $900 these wow. boots. All the way to the top. That's you see the difference? Some of them don't have it all the way to the top. Yeah. Those do. That's why those are more, more expensive. Look at this one. And this is ostrich, huh? Ostrich and gator. He likes that color, huh? You know how long I've been telling Mikey to bring me here? <laughs> and we, we were supposed to have come. I know, many time. times. The stingray, you see this? The stingray right here. All over stingray. stingray. That's this is stingray. what they call American alligator. It's got a different tail. You see the different tail? It's yeah. Flat. Very rare in the states. That's really cool. So, so we got the biker ones out here too. All the biker boots. All the biker see, boots as well. You see. So anybody that likes you know different style, they can get them here. And then you have these for like the singers. These are for all the women. Women's. Women's. All this. All this right here. Medium square toe. Like the wide la, square toe. Tengo son como estas, pero de elefante. Una de estas de elefante. Son así, de elefante. ¿De nosotros? Sí, ustedes. Are you guys the biggest manufacturer of boots? No, las tiene. No? Oh, ok, ok, ya me acordé cuáles son. Tienes razón, no las tiene. No las ordenó este. What is it? Are you the biggest manufacturer of cowboy boots in the world? I'm the biggest distributor of exotic cowboy boots. I know they're very, very popular. So what countries do you send your boots to? 
Well, they go as far as Russia, Australia, really? Italy, Germany. We export to South and Central America, and all over the states in Mexico. So, shoe. You dress up nice, you know, with, with a nice suit. Yeah, your shoes. Shoes. I've seen Mikey wear your hats in the ring, and the cowboy hat. Even tennis shoes. Uh, Where? All these. Oh, that's funny. Those are new casual shoes I want to use. I have a couple of these. Comfortable, huh? You have t cowboy shoes and a tennis shoe. <laughs> that's a new concept, but I'm sure it's very popular. Crocodile, stingray, yeah? ostrich, you name it. That's cool. These, like basket weave. Mm -hmm. You can tell the. Is it open? Yeah. You see the difference in this? Basket Can weave. You, tie? you see the basket weave? How yeah. It's woven. It's piping. It's What's the best leather? Well, the the most comfortable leather it's ostrich. It wears like a glove. And what? Then we have deer skin that is also very soft and comfortable. And what lasts the longest? And the ones that last the longer, it's pretty much what I'm wearing, the steam ray. Stingray? Stingray, Why? Stingray, you wear them every day, the whole year, and they never wear out. They don't? No. And how do you clean cowboy boots? Let's say I'm coming here and I buy a pair. How do you, um, how well, do you... my best recommendation, you take them to a shoe repair guy. That's a good one. So word. they can do a good job. Perfect. Do you have it? Anybody else? If Los Altos boots, you want to buy them, where would they go? They can look us up online, and they can, we can direct them to the nearest location in their city. And what would you tell Mikey Garcia about his next fight? He might be fighting in January. Well, I know he's a great fighter. I know he always prepares himself, and he's got a lot of discipline. I always wish him good luck, and I know he's going to win. There you have it, right here, Los Altos Boots. Check out their stuff. Really cool. FaceNewsReport.com. I'm Melissa, back reporting. Kids.